when the going gets tough in the game, you want to be on the touchline as a manager and you want to see those players who are going to go that extra yard to, to turn a, a draw into a win or a defeat in, into a draw. And that's kind of mentality, the strength of character, the winning mentality, who on the pitch is not going to accept defeat. Of course, you know, you've got to make sure players who you bring in have got the capability to do that. Last foot, but Mendy's there. Mendy from range. Oh, my goodness! Now Jacob Mendy will have a pop and heads. Well, we watched Jacob a lot, and in the summer we were trying hard to get him, and we got knocked back several times by Bournemouth. We looked at other players, and I always went back to him because I liked the hunger he played with. My whole life has been a challenge. I've got a strong mentality because of um, what I've grew up seeing. The example of my father, you know, taking us from Gambia to to um, Spain and then from Spain to the UK. I used to just look at my father and see how hard he, he, he worked. You just have to have the same energy and same mentality that he has because, you know, he, you know he's doing it for us. <laughs> Season ticket! Season ticket! Obviously, moving from country to country is, is always hard. When I actually moved to London six years ago, I saw how hard it is to, to move to a different country as an adult and, you know, having to, to work to pay the rent. Mira, locator. I used to obviously play and work at the same time. So I had two jobs as well. I was doing a cleaning job and I used to work about 12 hours a day. So it was harder for me to find a club and then it wasn't great. No. I liked the story of him coming over to England, playing in a non-league in, in Wilston, first of all, working on a building site and then moving to Bournemouth. And I just felt his hunger and kind of rawness would fit in well, would be a good addition to the group we had.